this morning Emily is driving, which is good for me. We're heading up Little Cottonwood Road to the trailhead for Mount Superior and Monte Cristo. Uh, it's about 2,500 feet in elevation gain and a little over five miles total um, out and back. It's a beautiful ridge walk and peak hike. It's pretty straight up, but a shorter hike, so it should be good. We have tons of Gatorade, we have some snacks, and we're gonna kill this thing. Hopefully it doesn't kill us first though. We are in the small little mountain town of Alta. It's 8,460 feet up. So you start pretty high already, but it's just a cool little mountain town. Big ski resorts and stuff. We did Sugarloaf and Devil's Castle back up in there the other day. That was amazing. And now we are headed up. Ooh, you can see them. Just starting to glow from the sun. Little baby beautiful moon right there. And we got Stretch and Emily right here. And here we go. Let's do it. You ready, honey? We're going to kill it. Ladies and gentlemen. Man, it is a beautiful morning. The sun is just peeking up over the ridge over here, over uh, Mount Wolverine. Lighting up the valley down below and lighting up Little Cottonwood Canyon. It's gonna be a great day. Made it up to the first ridge. Now we're gonna shoot back that way up to Monte Cristo and Mount Superior. We're looking at Twin Peaks. We're looking at Sugarloaf. We're looking at Devil's Castle and the Alta. There's our resort down there where we're gonna slam a beer or three after this hike in the afternoon. Back this way is an unbelievable valley. I'm not sure what it is. Maybe I'll throw it up on the screen just so we know. Oh, and it's just gonna get better. Wow. We are on a little ridge, flat ridge that I'm really enjoying right now. And we're gonna get an awesome look at our final ascent up. Oh my gosh, Mount Superior and then to Monte Cristo. This is probably one of my favorite trails and we're not even, we're not even to the good stuff. Whew. And here is a man that is a beast. This guy's amazing. Look at him go. That guy was like a hundred years old in the best shape anyone in the world. I can't believe that. He's like running this stuff. Wow. We just ran into a couple that talked to that old guy that I just videotaped. And he has been just, he's been peaking all morning and he just did the whole this whole ridge. And he's running off of it. <laughs> I'm blown away. I gotta know that guy's secret. I don't it's not know. Beer. It's not beer at night, so maybe I'll stop drinking <laughs> beer after hikes. Probably not, but <laughs> it was the biggest fly I've ever seen in my life. Just landed on my arm. It was like as big as a bat. That was amazing, that old guy.
How are you feeling? I'm good. <laughs> wobbly legs. Oh, they're gonna be even more wobbly up there. Woo, what a view. What a view. <laughs> How lucky am I? I get to go hiking with my wife. My kids aren't here. These hikes we've done are too beastly. But I am so lucky to have somebody who wants to do these monsters with me. Ah. That over there is Superior Razor Ridge. People climb up it and then come down what we just did. Maybe someday we'll do that because that looks like a lot of fun. Maybe a little danger, but a lot of fun. And there she goes. Over this beautiful, sharp, dangerous, Mount Superior. <laughs> oh man, that's pretty straight up. We're uh, thinking our approach, and it's basically just grab a rock and go. Woo, you ready? We have no choice. We have no choice, we have to go. Otherwise, that looks it's a little technical. Back down there, we don't want to go back down there yet, no way. Wow, she is a mountain goat just traversing that like she's done it a thousand times. This is her second peak hike. We are so close. This is climbing. We're climbing. We're not hiking. So this is climbing? This is climbing. <laughs> and I knew it when that girl said she at the bottom scared. of this, she said, have a fun climb. <laughs> and I thought, <laughs> Huh? <laughs> <laughs> She's doing really good. Uh, yeah, this is, this awesome. is the most technical thing I've done. This is more technical than Angel's Landing. This is great. <laughs> We're so close, I can smell it. Everybody loves a false summit. <laughs> Love me a good false summit. Don't you? But it's really close. I think I would be fine just sitting right here. That is a good picnic spot. About 30 feet by 20 feet and flat. So that's good. Really good. And it's amazing. We made it to the top, Mount Superior. We have Monte Cristo right there. And we are gonna have uh, lunch in the most beautiful place in the world right now. 
We're gonna have our six dollar sandwiches and uh, just slam those. I'm gonna make a run across and do Monte Cristo real quick while she recovers, relaxes, slams Gatorade, whatever she has to do to prepare herself for the climb down, not the hike down, the climb down, right? That's the truth. You loved it though. <laughs> Scary, it was but it's gorgeous. technical for my liking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna eat and then I'm gonna go. It's gonna be great. All right, there's them behind me. I'm starting my saddle approach all the way to Monte Cristo. Hustle across so I don't leave the bride too angry. I'm trying to hurry so she doesn't get more annoyed of me as she already is. Sometimes the trail is the best thing in the world. That's pretty quick. This is kind of like when your parents let you go on a ride at Disney World and they just sit there and watch you. That's what I feel like Emily's doing for me right now. They just love you so much that they just let you go and go and go because they don't want to go anymore. <laughs> that was like going up a thousand stair steppers. And here I am, ready to summit Monte Cristo. And I'm gonna die. Whew, what a day. Pushing the bounds of reality, letting Emily sit over there by herself. So, this is the send off to another completed hike, climb, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Monte Cristo, Mount Superior. I really hope you like this because this was amazing to hike. But uh, please subscribe, like, that helps with all the algorithms for YouTube. And uh, see you on the next one.